the catamon be? Yes. <laughs> Mommy wants a cat. She wants to keep it. <laughs> Yeah, frog's good too. This is why the video hasn't come out yet because they're busy working. It'll come out eventually. Soon. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, we're finally leaving the motherland for good. Uh, it has been an amazing experience out here, moving around, kind of doing our own thing and pretty much living life out here. But um, I don't know, it's just back in the skies we go for a little <laughs> bit, you know, that's all I can say. Um, I'm really hoping she does good on this, on this plane. Because she gave us a run for our money on the train. So I'm a little nervous about this one now. But other than that, I had, we had an amazing experience out here. Uh, shout out to uh, Miss Lucy and Mr. John for allowing us to um, house seat while we was out here for a little bit of time. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Uh, and yeah, like I was saying. It's, it's actually sad to go because we didn't met so many amazing people. Yeah. We didn't pretty much kind of like built a routine out here and now it's time for us to go. So it's a little bit sad and a little bit exciting at the same time because now we get to go somewhere new. And yeah, so right now we're actually sitting at the terminal, uh, not the terminal, the, the bus, the shuttle bus, waiting for the bus to come get us So we ended up going to the wrong terminal. Yeah, we had to say bye too soon. And yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Okay, if anything, we felt pretty prepared, but I'm not saying anything to jinx. I'm not trying to jinx us or anything, but we were hoping, because funny enough, our fight and our parents' fight is the exact, around this exact same time. And so we thought we we're gonna be, get through check-in and security and wait together. But apparently they're like, you gotta go to a different shuttle. I mean, a different terminal. That's what we're doing. So we had to separate a little too early. But yeah. let's just hope the rest of the events go smoothly. Hope you guys come along with us as we, uh, like I said, get back in these skies. And... <laughs> this one. <laughs> yes. I guess this is the second terminal. It's our first time pulling up on this one. Hopefully they got some, well, at least they got a coffee spot. Alright guys, we gotta go walk up all these stairs to get on our flight. So we have about, what? Five hours? Flight. Oh, this is a five hour flight? To Dubai. Yeah, then we have a five hour layover in Dubai. Yeah. So we're gonna be going a while. So, yeah, we a little bit of a rush. We're gonna show you how this is. <laughs> Two empty seats right next to us, and we're praying. 
Ukraine. By the way things are looking now, all of a sudden out of the blue, I doubt it. I'm praying nobody sits next to us, so we can have all four seats to spread out and sit in, because Moby can sleep in the middle, he's in this corner, and I'm in that corner. <laughs> That'll be a lovely flight, and I think she's going to fall asleep. I just give her some milk, she out, hopefully for the whole flight, and she's got them kids today. Oh, and another thing, it was pretty seamless today for a travel day, which is phenomenal. Even though the baby did kind of give us a little bit of hard time about Ah. Oh yeah, but but nothing too crazy. So we're happy, right? <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> but on that case, pray with us. We can have the best luck ever, <laughs> right? You coloring. We got lucky because guess what? We got the whole four seats. Finally landed, landed in um, Dubai, Dubai Airport, where our labor layover is at. And right now we're relaxing at this lounge, and it's a really nice lounge. They have a lot of pastries. Um, they have some like Asian and Indian dishes. It, it appears to be, and it's just it's just a really nice lounge. And they also have a, like a little massage area too, where you can get you a nice little massage at. Five-hour layover before we get back on a plane and head over to our final destination.
do this. I'm ready for this last flight. Baby girl fell asleep like 10 minutes before we bought it. But it's fine. Hopefully she'll bounce right back to her sleep. Go ahead. Hopefully so, because she gave us a bunch of money on her first flight. Mm -hmm. She was... The beginning half. Yeah, the first flight. No, 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 the first half of the flight. Because she slept. It is true. She did a good job. Yeah, hopefully, bless she, hopefully she fall asleep in this one. But let's go. We got like, what, 40 minutes before we board? They were already boarding. They were already boarding? I think so. But we need to go on go. All right, let's Okay, we finally arrived in Turkey. We are very happy to say it's been seamless. There's been no issues at all. So now we're just gonna get our baggage and get on out of here. At least go try to find our Airbnb because we're supposed to meet with the host. So in that case, let's find this stuff. While Dre is waiting for our last luggage, which is our stroller, yeah. our car seat to come through, and for the moment, the food that we're given from the airlines. They were actually so nice enough to give us some food and just Bye. a lot of little, I guess I'll just say like gifts. So, but this one's coming in handy. And Bye. Granted, we packed Uchi, mm. but this is nice and something different for her to eat while we're waiting for Dre, and so she won't be as cranky. Right? <laughs> All right, back for the mommy Bye. the luggage. Bye. Bye. We found the car seat. We should have known to keep them separate. Okay, we arrived, but now we're trying to figure out our transport situation because we could have gone with the bus. But it was taking way too long, like an hour and a half. But usually on our first time around trying out a destination, we don't like to do that only because we have a lot of things. We were able to speak to a taxi and they were like double the price of Uber. So we're just gonna get an Uber. So we just, I think we found it, but we'll see. Dre's trying to call my now. video we get ourselves acclimated in Turkey the new name of the country Turkey we gave ourselves a challenge to only use local transportation to move around town using the rail and the many versions of buses they have man was it a challenge we found ourselves still wandering late night see you on the next one <laughs>